This P2197 repairing video is dedicated to Honda's drivers. If your Honda is getting a P2197 error code, this video is going to show you 4 practical solutions to fix the error code at home. Use the Zeus app to scan your vehicle and see the error code P2197. It indicates that the oxygen sensor is fluctuating outside its optimal range. Here are four of the most practical solutions to fix Honda's P2197 error code. Method A, fuel injectors. The fuel injectors are mounted in the intake manifold so that they spray fuel directly at the intake valves. Inspect the leaking fuel injectors on the fuel rail. Carefully remove the fuel injector. Make sure the new injector has new seals, and never use the old seals over. When you change the fuel injectors, change them all as a set, otherwise the engine will run unevenly. In order to prevent leaking, get some gasoline, put it in a cup, and then dip the new fuel injector into it. So the seals may get wet with gasoline, and it will go in and won't leak. After all, just slide all the new fuel injectors in. Method B, Exhaust Leaks The exhaust system begins at the engine combustion chambers, and runs along the undercarriage of the vehicle, eventually ending with a visible tailpipe. If you have a small leak around the corner, get some exhaust putty to seal it up. First, get a sandpaper, and a wet wipe to clean the leaking area for better application. Stir the paste well to activate it. Apply and press the paste to seal the leaking area. After the application, don't start the engine, because the positive pressure from the exhaust will blow out the paste. Let it cure for 2-24 hours, depending on the external temperature. The hotter it is, the quicker it will cure. That means, you can use something like a hair dryer to heat it up, and make it cure faster. Exhaust pipes are made out of rolled steel, and there is a welded seam on it. Like this one, the seam will often rot a leak. First, get a sandpaper, and a wet wipe to clean the leaking area for better application. Get the heat wrap out, and put it in the water, for about 30 to 40 seconds to start the activation process. Then, remove it and squeeze out any excess water. Wrap it around the area, and overlap it a couple inches on each side. Repeat the process 3 or 4 times. Then squeeze it to make the resin go all through it. Start the car, and let it run for 30 minutes, so the heat cures it and makes a permanent fix. Method C, the MAF sensor. MAF sensors are located between the air filter and the throttle body. Carefully remove the MAF sensor from your car and do a quick inspection around. The wire inside often gets dirty and needs to be cleaned. You can spray the MAF sensor cleaner onto the wire perpendicularly to the ground, so that it won't damage the MAF sensor. Reinstall the MAF sensor back in the car after it gets dry. Method D, the oxygen sensor. This oxygen sensor is located right before the catalytic converter. Bank 2 is on the side with cylinder number 2. Sensor number 1 is usually the one in the exhaust manifold. Visually check the oxygen sensor's electrical connections, wire harness, and metal tabs for any damages. If damages are found, replace the oxygen sensor. So here are four of the most practical solutions to fix Honda's P2197 error code. After the repair, you can now use the Zeus app to clear the error code. And tap the rescan button one more time to make sure everything is fine with your vehicle.